Hello guys! So now we're going to cook ginisang upo with shrimp and ground turkey. So the ingredients are onion, garlic, chicken bouillon, tomatoes, uh, black pepper, salt, shrimp, uh, ground turkey, and the uh, upo. So let's go! So we need to slice into a small piece the opo so it's easy to cook. So the opo is cut already into a small piece and let's start. So now we're starting to pour oil and saute all the spices. Let's wait until the oil will be hot enough to saute the spices. Now the oil is hot so we can put the onion. Then the garlic. And let's saute until when it, it it turns to color brown the tomatoes any kind of tomato as long as you have tomato so I use cherry tomatoes this is from our backyard <laughs> then the next will be the ground turkey so we're going to cook the ground turkey and we're going to wait when it turns to brown, golden brown. When it is golden brown, it means it is cooked. So you can notice that uh, the meat it turns to light brown now, but we still need to mix this so everything will turn to color brown. Then the next one we added is the opo. Then stir it. And we're going to wait when the opo will be soft. Can add the 
add the shrimp. that chicken broth I dissolve that chicken broth into the hot water and we can mix it here and stir it and we will cover it and, and let's wait until the shrimp it turns to color red and the uh, opo is cooked Let's cover it and wait for a few minutes. So now it looks ready. The opo is cooked and the shrimp. So now we're gonna add the black paper. Black paper, guys. Put salt as many as you want, <laughs> but don't put too much. So our opo, ginisang opo with shrimp and brown turkey is ready. Let's eat. Ready to serve. Thank you for watching and please subscribe and click the notification bell. Thank you.